As promised, here's the video of our visit in the Dr. Pepper Museum in Waco, Texas. The Dr. Pepper Museum is open year-round except on Easter, Thanksgiving, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, and New Year's Day. Monday to Saturday at 10 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. Sunday at 12 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. Photo ops outside the museum include a Dr. Pepper Green 1940s delivery truck. Awesome, thank you. Ready to read a lot of facts when you come into this museum. Starting the museum experience in a space dedicated to telling the story of a carbonated water as a popular precursor to the invention of the popular sodas.
brands is put all the Dr. Peppers on the right side of the coolers. I did have to move some of the other brands around to make room for the Dr. Peppers, but sure enough, the sales increased just because I made it a little easier for a customer to get a cold bottle of Dr. Pepper. Drink a bite to eat at 10, 2, and 4 became the greatest slogan. During the 1920s, research at Columbia University determined that the people's blood sugar tended to fall around 10 a.m., 2 p.m., and 4 p.m. Dr. Pepper was invented in Waco, Texas in 1885 by a pharmacist named Charles Alderton. While working in Wade Morrison's Old Corner Drugstore, Alderton noticed how patrons loved the sweet smell of the soda fountain and decided to create a drink that tasted like a familiar smell. Originally made in Morrison's Old Corner Drugstore, Wade Morrison, the drugstore owner, named it Dr. Pepper. Now we are heading to the East Wing building, which is the building with the red neon Dr. Pepper sign on the side. This is where you can get your free drink in their soda fountain. You need to make a reservation for one of their special programs, which is a make a soda, taste a soda, or your extreme Dr. Pepper experience.